1976-77 is the highlight of my career when we just finished the home series against New Zealand at home and then after about a couple of days we had to depart for Australia on a two-month tour and having won against New Zealand the boys were very confident all I mean we went in a good spirit and played Greg Chappell was captain then of Australia and we played a very formidable side you know Thompson, Lily and Marsh and and Gary Gilmore and Walters and many others what a, what, a, what a force it was uh, and to do well against them uh, it was really uh, we were quite touched with our um, performances we won for the very first time against Australia in, in Sydney and uh, that was fantastic uh, uh, we made a blunder in picking the side up again in, in Sydney uh, test match against Australia, and we only picked two seamers on a wicket was seaming around. And uh, there comes a situation in the, in the third of, uh, on the fourth day, that we had to bowl Australia out uh, in the third inning, and uh, cheaply, so we can knock off the whatever runs they get. And Safraz and um, Imran Khan, both bowled magnificently and they, they, they bowled the whole session from morning to lunch. I, I didn't take them off, they, they, they bowled about <coughs> you know, 12 hours each or 13 hours each spell and then we came in, we got about 3 or 4 weeks, uh, we had the upper hand, we had the grip on, on the game and so in the lunch hour we said well I, I can't afford to take you off. Uh, you have to keep going and they said oh we are tired yeah i said well you forget it you know you got it just mentally tough you know, if, if, if you lose the grip we will come back and uh, we didn't have third simmer so i can rotate them around there was no and uh, so i said well, they said okay i said take your time going back to your mark don't worry about it how long it takes and you to to bowl and over and I said just you are just bowling fine, just keep and uh, they really bowled magnificently. Both of them and they bowled from morning eleven o'clock to the lunch and after lunch right up to the tea. By that time we had them well uh, under our cover and then you know we, we, we bowled them out quite uh, and they in the end we had to get thirty four to win in the third or fourth inning which uh, uh, Majid Khan played well and he got 26 out of 32 and then, then we won the game. So that was a great um, uh, happy occasion for us and we, we, it lifted our team up. And then after that, uh, that was the last match of the tour and then from there on we got straight to, uh, we went to play West Indies. And the rest of these were a big team. Clive Lloyd, Kelly Churin, Greenwich, and you know, Hay Desmond Haynes, and Fast Bowlers, Garner, Croft, Andy, uh, Andy Roberts, and uh, uh, well, Riv Richard. Riv Richard as well. That was Riv Richard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's right. Uh, and uh, then we had a good competitive series against them as well. And we should have won the first test match, but uh, it wasn't to be. A few decisions didn't go in our favour. Otherwise, we would have won the first test match in Barbados. But then we carried on. We lost the second one at Trinidad. Third one was um, at Guyana, was a draw. Then we came back to play the fourth test match in Trinidad today and uh, at the Port of Spain. Uh, we won that. <laughs> and uh, that was a, a sort of a limelight of my career that I scored 100, 121 and I took 5 wickets in the first inning and then at second inning I got 56 and took another 3 wickets and then and so I was declared man of the match and uh, we won the test match, we leveled the series and won to play it and that was a final test match in Jamaica. Uh, you know, and uh, 
where the West Indians took the upper hand and they, they produced the wicket which suited their bowlers. And Fred Ingham, they, they were playing home series, so um, they were better than us on those wickets. And uh, But still, we played well, and the match lasted till about four and a half to five days. And the West Indies won the last test match. But the test two series, one after the other, was the best of my cricketing career.